up for a fight towards Zach. Right here. Really just King playing solo B right now. Push wall out from EG. This is pretty uh, similar to how they were playing the comp previously. Double lurk going up into mid. They love to run these B pinches down underneath the tube. They're going to get walled off, though, for a moment here, and that'll slow things down in the round. Jaw is on the other side of this and waiting to push through. Oh, that's that's clear the close corner, though. So two straight kills for Lab. Apop is going to try and make something of this round. It's found his way up over onto the site, but Mizuno takes it down, and now Superman is getting routed. It's all individual fights that leave it on to nature. 1v3 with a flank incoming. Off boss already so close up behind nature. Somehow slipped past him. But Ospos is going to see that shoulder and take him down. Three players survive, and honestly, I think this is fantastic prep work from Lev. Seeing that game EG played on this map a couple weeks ago, uh, and seeing that they went for so many of those mid pinches, Leviathan were so yeah, ready because they have the freedom on that second out. smoke agent to be able to block off things like the Killjoy turret. But a lot of the time, they're going to open up strong right. over into this B side using that push wall just to secure orbs, get those ults online. So and far, just farming on the nature. Yeah, and this is something EG does a lot, even on the Rico rounds, really prioritizing orb maxing. Even without the ISO, this is still a comp that has a lot of power alts that can start to snowball this attacking side. So EG, upon getting their orb towards B, will start to head back over towards A main, where that orb is still unclaimed, but maybe just trying to work towards me instead. Get a pick here. Yeah, see what they can do with this pack mentality. They'll use these club smokes in the mid round. I think they have pretty much uh, good info that they are going for mid and stuff. Yeah. Oh wow, dude. Expos is farming. Expos is farming. Jogma is this. Okay, good job. But now his position has been notified and Lever gonna shrink onto that spike. Jaw has recovered a guardian here. But whipping out. Oh wow, he whiffed on that. Advantage of it. Lev able to convert fairly cleanly there to get up to Spike. Not a part of this play. And Lev is heavy committing into this space. Ospos will get forward. Messino on the low ground, though. Not quite spotted in time. And Lev get a clean double to start the round and will retreat. There you go. They came for. Can instantly fall out out of that, sending a, a little drone from Com to see. Yep, the rotates did in fact come out. Leviathan just leaving King with the ghost to hold on site. As EG keeps scaling back over into the B side. No time wasted to pick up that orb. Instead, just doing their best to get the plant on the ground. And they do have the Sage Wall, which will guarantee that for themselves. They want to try and get something here. A walk up as that plant is trying to be committed. Derek will get it down, but oh, Love really well set up for the retake here. A dart from Calm ready to go. I love yeah. the position on top side taken from Apoth already. They need these opening fights to go their way, but Love haven't really given them that just yet. A they come. Apoth is going to be critical here. Holding on towards top side. Finds a double great connection from him. Jaw will help out in the round as well. And now this is suddenly slipped away from Leviathan. Both players spotted towards spawn, blocked off by two different walls. And Thank this you. round is all but done. Calm spots one and we'll get that kill. But a round win will not follow. That is a great post plant and EG already showing the difference with that Sage coming into the comp. Walling off Snowman actually allowed Apoth to get that top side position. They focused just two of their crosshairs on uh, on top kitchen, on under tube, and win their fights out very convinced. Nice. really do think just outclass the pick. Very early days, just one round win, but I like the utility we've seen so far. Oh yeah, and again, Ospos is going to take his space in a main. Got the openers in last round. That was a 3v5 that EG won. Ospos sitting with a lot of money in the bank, too. 3,800 could have gone for the op, and I think EG sort of fearing that maybe a little bit. Slow to scale forward using those Sage slows, too, just to make sure an aggressive line couldn't be taken over towards Belt. Derek still has full utility to push Ka King off this angle. Just keep your eyes on the mid space, right? Right now, Supa is just there holding behind his smoke, but he really likes to challenge under tube in the middle of these rounds, oftentimes pairing up with Nature or even Jogamo to go on hunting into mid. Dark doesn't scan anything outside A, and Nature's going to take his timing here. He hears those footsteps. 
sneaking back up into the space, but there's an alarm bot right in front of him. Should spot it out and maybe even pull some players back onto the A site from Web. Yeah, here comes Ospos. Feeling they need to stick around in this area. Yeah, EG actually threw out the hard wall. Get that kill from Apoff too. At the same time, Nature broke the alarm, so Lever pulled all sorts of ways. Left. That was a Sage Wall boost combined with that gap in the Harbor Wall to get the opening kill, but they could still call back into A here. Nature spotted out. Ospos takes him down, easing up the pressure on A, but B is falling yeah. apart. Look at Jogamo. Two different fights back Fight into planted. Snowman. King is still hiding out on site, but <laughs> there's no avail. I mean, Apoff top site once again. EG are dominating the B site. No matter the agent, no matter the position, you can always trust Jaw to bail EG out of a round like that. Look at that Sage Wall they used to boost up there onto Yellow. That is so nice. I love the creativity. EG, I mean, thinking back even like two 2022 NA Challengers with Potter had all the different post plant spam yeah. on Icebox, the Sage tech too. No real surprise that EG are going to work that back into the comp somehow. Yeah, no matter the, the addition of this team, whichever players are on the roster, if it's Potter and EG, there is going to be something cooked up. They're always trying to be on that cutting edge of the meta. Osboss needs to hold on to a rifle to chuck back to a teammate. Two kills is pretty good. Oh. Res comp that EG are actually running. This time Osboss will buy the operator. Focus on a more passive angle. But EG are very cautious of this. EG always open their rounds with a push wall threatening that they're stepping into the space behind it. So Leviathan have to take active angles on the defense tab information. That's the off towards A. That's King playing forward in B main too. They know B main is open for the time being. So Ospas is going to hold his ground. Just work his way into finding an angle. Calm. Throwing out the space. Apoff and alt ready to go. Can Ospas get anything done on this operator? He's pushed away. Mizino trying to stick around for a moment, but those stuns from the ultimate will stop any opportunity. What is Jaw doing? He's up in the air. He's trying to jump around this site. Gets away with no kills exchanged, but pressure certainly applied. Throws up in the stratosphere right there. Jaw going with the ult in hand, but I mean, evil geniuses, they've got the plant down on the ground, the ultimate to try and get back into the site. Levy and Tom, though, flooding out and having all five players, maybe. It's blood. It's so fast already, Apoth goes one for one, but the alt is dissipated, and EG still have space in maze. Jaw on the swing, alarm bot active, but King takes him down. Rez is gone, and it's even in a 3v3. Mazzino, a double, and King helps out to Leviathan. Make the retake work. I mean, Mazzino and King have been playing out of their minds. Their series up against 100 Thieves on Bind especially. There are rounds where they're the only two players alive against five and they're winning it out. Now King gets an ultimate off of those couple of kills, off of the defuse there as well. Really gonna win. That they are. Some ultimates to work with here. See if they can find any openers. Working into the space, but Hossboss on that off angle right behind the turret. Baiting out, but we'll just break it in the end. One thing EG are lacking with the change from the ISO to the Sage, Previously, normally when you're playing the Viper, you'll have Viper Molly Shock Dart to deny that A orb. With the ISO, they use the Vulnerable in that Shock right. Dart. But now you don't have a PC Util to combine, so it's a lot harder to deny Lev orbs. Yeah, you'll have ideas like a Sage Slow plus the Shock to guarantee the damage, but that's not going to mean a kill for you. They're just walking through the wall. What is going on here? Mazzino is just right there for two easy kills. Can back up into the one way, too. Peek around not going the way of EG. Still, they'll get an ult online here, but Mazzino making himself a menace back yellow as Suba has found a way in. So now, Mazzino right suddenly there. finds himself a little bit isolated here at yellow. His Soba looking his way over, but Mazzino doesn't need the help. Four kills found. Spike looking for the ace. Can Supa give it to him? A swing out from the globe. Mazzino won't get it this time, but it's a round win for Lev nonetheless. Good guy took dart in there too. Now it's just gonna be the, the regular old dart there using that slowed help on scale forward. My Push wall breaks ready. the line. Ospos is trying to hold with the operator two there. That's the all for Supa. Now this round is on a timer. EG have to get him a get him a chance and off the timer will now. Not give one. Here's another red light for Superman. He's back into the round here, but it's ults to react from the other side. Both the Killjoy ultimate and this Hunter Sphere committed will equalize this round. The timeout was, hey, Supa, do your best. We got you. <laughs> Two reses, and they're still back into the game. And we're it's 40 seconds into the round, but it's the same push wall. It's just like it's a minute 40 on the clock. This time, though, can use that drone to try and push Ospos off the angle. And he is seen. No dash for Ospos. 
Smokes will get him into backside though. And a Hunter's Fury being put in here for Evil Geniuses. Here comes the scale off of that one. Aspa still alive and not removed from his position in the back of sight. Now a more active angle established. And as the Viper Wall falls, I think they believe they cleared that angle. It's one for one for Aspa's come. Able to fight back in. Now an ult can be up top. Just dunking on his former teammate. There he is. Get another. What the hell is he doing? This guy's playing a different game. He's up in the skies. 2v2 now, 20 seconds. EG still have to find some way to get the spike on the ground. And they've split up. One to the right, one to the left. Derek about to face off two players. The clock is ticking down, winding down. The smoke is gone, and it's all on John. The first fight goes his way. Four kills in the round. Down to five seconds, and John through the wall gets the ace. How has he done that? At I buy power on socials, where that giveaway is happening. Hashtag unlock your ace. Back into the round now, EG slowing it down. They don't want to overfight into A main. I think they realized that that round was completely saved by Jog, who, by the way, started the round by ulting and is now three orbs away from having that back up again. So yeah, that's reasonable. Th I mean, that's a good reason to pick the Sage, Mimi. <laughs> oh, yes, of course. When your Sage gets an ace every round. Yes, like Jaw is prone to do. EG up into B main just now. Four players on half armor here. Ospas's outlaw can do a lot of damage. Another wall for Jaw. They're flying back in off this harbor util, but Ospas finds a gap to get out. Mazino takes one of his own. That'll open up this round, but Jaw has slipped the net and found the fight, but Mazino wins it regardless. He has been steadfast on this site. His V anchoring has been perfection. Ospas can't really find the shots. And as a matter of fact, looking at this round now, that Sage Wall kind of slowing EG down. They can't go for the safe plant, just hugging the wall. Gonna have to bust it down themselves, and there's already four players of Leviathan over in this area. Maybe a Killjoy ult to use if they left. need to, but Evil Geniuses, they gotta get the spike down first. And without the Sage Wall to help them plant, I don't know if this is actually gonna happen. They're gonna fight through their own smokes, but that's straight into the domain of Mizzino. It is a one-for-one one fight, but 15 seconds, everyone from Leviathan is making their way over to B. Plant will come down. But Derek is stuck out. He swings back. He's going into this outlaw, and there's no way he can escape that situation. Lev winning by attrition in this one as they leave the rounds onto nature. They're spotted out and spammed through the smoke. A lovely reply from Leviathan. I mean, if, if Lev can just keep banking on their B anchors of King and Mizzino to get rounds like that. No peeking. Boss boss looking under tube now, but instantly smoked off by the globe. Actually, a bit of a pivot, Leviathan, looking for that mid-angle early on, switching over into... Look at Ja! He's just completely slipped under, but now nah, Ospos is ready for it. Even ready for that second player. Nature gets around the corner, and that's going to be Ospos out of bullets, but... Lev in a great spot after another kill from Azino, another kill from King, from Tex, every single angle that EG are trying to step through on their low buys. Oh. That's a flawless anti-eco for Leviathan. On those rounds, big ults now, though, for EG to be able to work in. Changing the setup here for Lev. This time they're fighting through B. Ospas has wow. already pushed quite deep. He's got a fight. Super clears the angle, but not wow. fast enough. Yeah, that basically forces EG to accelerate into the into the Killjoy, into the Viper's pit. It's over here too. Leviathan have a great setup. You should run. Killjoy ultimate gonna be used from EG on this round. They're really putting everything into it. That'll force this Viper out of the pit. I don't think any way to break this one. Shock's coming through, but no second piece of utility. So, Leviathan off the side. Jaw on another wall. I think maybe missing out on that one. Goes a little bit lower, and now kind of locked off from the team in main. Level invests the Reckoning. Calm already swung into back sight. Ichi is fully trapped behind these walls. They have no replay coming. It all comes down to these duels in main. Harbor Koba, Derek alone, and taken care of King on a double of his own. And this is another clean retake for Lev. That is a huge misstep from Jaw there. Missing the wall. It, it effectively boxed EG off the side. I mean, that's a defender's wall. Way. Yeah. That is, that is a tough situation to be in there, too. Also, the Clove dying in Potter. This is very typical of her. If a, if a half is not going well, she will burn through those timeouts to try and reset things. Only two rounds to try and course correct here on their attack. So EG send that same default over towards A, but this time fixate on this B site where Ospas is stationed. The first time Ospas has opted on this side. 
It's always a push wall on the right side where Calm is playing, Here. but never to cover Ospos' angle. Ospos spots out Jaw, but that's a great jit eagle, and uh, that slow orb will push level way. The way EG scale too, just so many smokes, removing any chance for forward offline. Ospos has been pushed back, but Supa found that pick in mid, and that is massive. All of a sudden, Leviathan, they've got to respond to that space, knowing EG love to step into that area, especially with the re-smoke down. Here comes the re-aggression for Lev. Two players grouped in this close smoke, waiting for the drop. Now just walk through the space. They've been stepping in front of EG smokes all day. This time, though, Leviathan creep into spawn. Tex and King just holding, waiting for that lead rotate. Seconds left. They I know there's been an, a player oh. towards a so often. This time, though, EG accelerating over into the B site. Same wall goes. Up comes ready for it, but it's a 1 4 1. King trying to spy from backside currently, dodging away from the Hunter's Fury. With 15 seconds left, the spike is going to be hard to actually find a plant. Apoth found a kill. King goes down, and so does the spike. There's a fight on the flank here. Tax trying to win this one against Derek. He needs to isolate the fight, and he does. But Derek's better with the Sheriff. Now a 1v4 for Ospos. There's players everywhere. A flank headed his direction. A Sova in mid. And that timer ticking down. An isolated fight onto nature. Won't be given away. A swing ready from back yellow. And the players will encroach as EG take a thrifty round. EG on a fight towards A as we've seen many times before. And Lev yet again getting control of that altar. Early dash, just 10 seconds in. Ospos not even taking a shot with that one. Zeno's all on his own here. Some killjoy utility to play on with as he falls back into yellow, but he's looking for that opener first. Not anymore, though, as he gets revealed by the dart. Zeno back yellow. Cove and a teammate ready to swing off in bottom site. It's just contact for EG. Supa and Apoth both win their fight. Hunter's Fury will come as a reaction to that. But Calm only gets one kill, and that's a res coming through for Supa. Now his job, fight. Try and get as much done with this Glove Ultimate as possible, and King was not ready for that. And surely, you gotta be prepared for this Glove to keep on swinging Supa. We'll lose out on the second duel, but still, Last this is the 4v2, cut down to just one. It's Ospos with an operator. And oh, so much to do. EG have just about saved this half. Ospos not done fighting just yet, but Apoth will send him to the grave. A good recovery from off Ospos with a 2k! Okay! Out of nowhere. And suddenly an advantage for Leviathan. Now, Superman in a bit of trouble here, alone on the site, but a smoke to play around. He'll swing out straight into the welcoming arms of Mazzino, and Ospot says one by one, EG will fall, and Lev will find only that one left to claim their pistol. Oh dear. That is... You have to back away and deny that orb. They're also not playing forward into B main either, so they don't have really any chance to win back the little game on this eco of getting those orbs. On both sides now, it seems like this game has been defined by winning this A fight. And more times than not, Leviathan is taking this space. Such is the way of Icebox. <laughs> a tale as old as time. And Leviathan going to be forcing their way through this one. Ja just pushed off the angle a little bit. Again, that sight smoke. Yeah. This is a four stack, though. A little bit of danger in the round still for Lev. Lev's but they're suspicious. Yeah, their prep should tell them that EG <laughs> do like to stack up for this A sight. Still might just want to power through anyways. Just take those fights where they know they're going to be. And yeah, that's, that's pretty Ospos. much the Ospos way. Wow. Another two quick kills. And, uh, and he's out. They don't even want to excel into that one. Cautious of the rest of the players being here. And oh, this might be working. Fake on the drop. Superman walking up close. 30 seconds he left. Oh, he oh. And he spotted out. Does win the fight against Ospos. But that rifle oh. should be recovered. And despite the two falling... This is still Three a winning one. position Three for one. Leviathan. Yeah, Leviathan's going to know have, have to try something from a position like that. I like the patience. Choosing to stay clumped, fight together. Not really take too many chances in a round like this.
that's something I want to credit for this team. I think they've, especially stage two, done a really good job of finding the right timings to pause in their attacking mid rounds. They're, you never really see them super overheating off of one of those opening kills for Osboss, so as things might have gotten a little bit more dangerous than expected, but with King staying alive, that means both rifles bought into this round yeah. are saved, and all's actually fine. Ultimately, you need, we're just going to be able to pick up the rifle anyways. Calm is just, you know, an archer anyways, throwing around silly uh, Scala, uh, Scala, uh, Scala, uh, Scala, sacrifices. Ryan, so come this Very weak B side of the map again. Evil geniuses like to play retake, and even with the, the sage wall, it makes their B retakes even better. They're walling off yellow, just walling off main, just walling the, the spike to the full stick. Got there a lot of options to play people. that one slow. Two people actually thought one solo is going into snowman. Now there's a reinforcement of three. And the KJ is looking mid. Gonna fight back into mid here with a pop, and King will spot them out. Chew the EG players back away. Check out no, B site though. Because, yeah, we're on his POV ball. right now. Osboss is doing his best yeah, pistol impression. Awesome just hanging out with Pack yellow. yellow. Left to go for a late wrap. Positioning of the Killjoy turret also won't see him. So as soon as Derek moves off of the B site, there is a gap. And actually, Osboss smoked himself. There was a dart that would have seen him. That lurk unrevealed as of yet. Still, super on that off angle gets an opener. And now Jaws Wall will keep them out of this A site. Yeah, but Lever gonna move all the way back now into Osboss because he smoked left. himself and avoided that information. This timing he is getting is completely is unexpected. Up? Now Evil Genius is like someone could have been D main and creep in, but the fact he's already in Snowman is really quick. There's a ping coming through and He spawn. saw him. Yeah, spotted from that off angle up top. Now this is falling apart for Osboss. Ten seconds. Clients is gonna come down in time Ten and the Xeno is ready for a refight from mid. Poff going through mid right now. He might be the one to see him, but nature too. Stuck in, about to step into a couple of different players. King right up and close, but he sees the gun. He can get the kill. Lev find two on the opposite side, though, and they are crushing in this post plant. Three on two now. Evil Genius is approaching from Snowman, but Leviathan know exactly what is up, and King get the 3k on Kong. Lev to double digits. Opening up that area as well. We're right back in the thick of things, though, pushing them again off of that orb. It's the anti-eco setup from Leviathan, making sure EG can't get anything. Bobby, welcome to the stream. Lev happy to just full contain this space in A. But EG are gonna rewalk right in. Super oh, okay. finds a timing with the drone in hand, but oh, wow. King has got the back of Kong. Dang. He'll still die to the Gasova on the other side, but that gun will not be recoverable. And it's an even exchange. I think Super was the only one who no gets the heal. Close to an ult too, so getting him out of the picture. Very so important. Cool. I mean, the, round, out, uh, the next few rounds are looking very good for Leviathan. Of course, they've got the money. EG are going to be buying in the next one, but Ospa should have knives. They're going to have uh, Mazino ult as well. I think Kong might be pretty close too. EG are not going to have any, so big chances for Leviathan to just run away with it from here. Killjoy you tilt on this B site will alert 30 seconds Evil geniuses that this is where the finish is coming from Lev. But they just don't have enough troops here to prevent the plant. That wall is going to threaten Osboss taking space all the way into Snowman. He's even dashing for it as well. So off the fall of this harbor wall, a duel is ready to go. King across, three players on the other side. And doubled up our Lev. The rifle's ready to fire and all three wow. are shut down. In an instant, Levy is like Apoff and Jaw. But Lev is just so consistent. Get out of my well, I'll way! I'll give you a hero. Jogamo with the up. Boosted on. Did he just not have money to buy the wall? I don't think so. Oh, wow. That's tough. Investing everything into run, having run, the up run. here. Not playing the Sage, he's playing the up. Still, a Hunter's Fury will push in and. Draws off this angle. Now these smokes start to become pretty oppressive as Osboss is Did I know he's pushed up? Blade storm on the approach. Oh wow. By a drone though. And Jaw will follow up on that kill. That is a great start for EG. Start going in. But this next layer of smokes to try and further stall. It's a reposition from a oh, single and it's perfection. Go front. A crossfire from the controllers. That's the CTs. And nature CTs. alone in mid. You gotta say this gun. Knows this round is over. Map point. Leviathan. I swear, w you, if you were watching a Leviathan game and you close your eyes, when you open them, one thing will have happened. 
Either Osboss has gotten an ace, or King and Mazzino have swung together, fought together, and killed everyone on the other team. That duo has just been absolutely Yeah, they absolutely the one that's been on throughout uh, stage two. Nature. And King's the one to complete that hunt. Wow. That duo, man. They're just those swings together, set up in the late round. Here, it's ready. And EG will change up a fast play towards A. Five guardians for evil geniuses with their B-sides and shambles. Nature is all on his own. What can he find from okay. back here? They know where he is. Is absolutely nothing. Osbos is still going, Mimi. Too good. What a start to this round. Tex oh, wow. on the fight. Now this oh, yeah. is just duel after duel. Oh, my but God. EG will pick up a few. 3v2 for a retake. Another fight coming back through mid. And Supa just got the res. It could be a three on three. EG played their cards right. Supa spotted drop. And they get this. Passing back Snowman. They're both and isolated here. Back. And Calm is on the prowl. Yeah, but this timing on the repush is perfection from Calm. Oh, Derek wow. not looking. It's a freebie. And now I mean, one man fish. to stand. Superman on the swing. A deep yeah, proceed through the cool. box. And Leviathan ready to put an end to things. GG. 13 to 5. A dominant start to this series on Icebox. Leviathan are just overwhelming evil geniuses, right? And their coordinated play is so locked in with how they're responding on the trades and the swing timings. But also, once they get an advantage in the round, you've got Osboss pushing your spawn, you've got...